Jim Keller. All right, well, we've got some news just out now on the banks. It is called the SLUs. You've heard it a lot so far today. We're talking Senior Loan Officer Opinion Survey, S-L-O-O-S, SLUs, to put it simply. It tells us how much or how little banks are actually lending. But given the current climate, it's getting a lot of attention for obvious reasons, and certainly today. CNBC.com's Jeff Cox is looking at the details for us. So let's talk SLUs. Is the economy still getting the money it needs to maybe, dare I say, grow? Well, Dom, the report today, which covers the first quarter of the year, didn't have a lot of surprises in terms of what's happening right now. Look, bank, lendings, bank lending standards are tightening. Demand is tightening. Credit standards are also, or, I'm sorry, credit quality is also deteriorating somewhat. The big news from today's report is that they asked several special questions of institutions about why they tighten standards and why, more importantly, they expect to continue to tighten standards. Um, and some of the answers there were kind of scary. Uh, first of all, they said in terms of why they did tighten standards. They cited an uncertain economic outlook, reduced risk tolerance, deterioration in collateral values, and concerns about banks' funding costs and liquidity positions. Now, when asked about wh what they see things looking like going forward over the next 12 months, the report says that banks most frequently cited an expected deterioration in the credit quality of their loan portfolios. Again, customers' collateral values, reduction in risk tolerance, and here's the big thing, concerns about bank funding costs, bank liquidity positions, deposit outflows, um, as reasons expecting to tighten lending standards over the rest of 2023. Of course, that translates into you know less lending, less economic growth. This is the very thing that the Fed's own economists warned policymakers about back in March and said they expected the credit issues to result in potential shallow recession as we go through the rest of the year. So that really Born out through this report today uh, doesn't generally get a lot of market attention, but I think a lot of folks are watching it today to see what we can expect going forward from the uh, banking community. OK, Jeff Cox, I mean, I, I'm hearing a lot more investors talking about the scrutiny on net interest margins at regional lenders as well. So it kind of jives with what we're seeing in SLUs. Thank you very much. We appreciate it.